when this e levy thing started, we had a special committee, both sides. Mm. We met and engaged as patriots. Our friends came with their position, how they wanted things done. Mm. They wanted a reduction. Even the threshold, they wanted it to be reduced further. But you see, they may not want to hear this, but that is the naked truth. The NDC caucus in parliament is being controlled by some forces, and those forces are looking at the 2024 elections. So they are being allegedly controlled by mm -hmm. political forces? I am forces saying that. With personal that, that, interests? No, no. I, or political interests? I've used words oh, okay. that I would own. Okay. Repeat my words. Okay? Your sole purpose is to win elections. Of course. Of course. And, and the because, basis of this because, is because, what exactly? Because, because, you see, in one breath, you are ready to share political risk with us. In another breath, you say that it's your risk, yet you are obstructing. We started. We started. High-powered delegation, not only MPs, but senior members of their party outside of parliament. Who are these forces you talk about? I am saying that we had a certain understanding. And as a result of that understanding, we reported back. You remember I was on your show, and sure, I was yeah. the first to announce the 1.5. 1. 1. 1. 5. 5. Remember? remember? Clearly, yes. yes. Good. Perhaps I was too quick to make that pronouncement, but it was necessary. I didn't say that accidentally. At that point, they were somewhere 1% and a little above. So you also and you remember, down. and you remember Harun Edrisu publicly declared a 1% and they were on his neck. They went, they wanted to kick him out of leadership. You remember? They, I didn't know they wanted to kick him out of leadership. Oh, please. That's I mean, they all descended on him. Because at that point, they said, no way. They were not ready for even the so the, even the one percent. So negotiations broke down. We had several meetings. Some senior members on our side joined leadership, and I was leading the team. And they also had their team. We tried all of these. Then it got to a point. It's like, oh, it's not us. It's a party decision. If it is your party decision to use e levy to fight 2024 election, tell Ghanaians. Don't tell Ghanaians that you are fighting for them because they are suffering.